सो गाइस आई एम रियली ऑब्सेस विद स्ट्रेंजर थिंग्स एंड व्हेन आई गेट नोटिफाइड दैट द न्यू सीजन इज नाउ स्ट्रीमिंग ऑन नेटफ्लिक्स आई जस्ट स्टॉप व्हाट आई वाज डूइंग एंड आई वाज गोइंग टू वॉच नेटफ्लिक्स सो इन दिस न्यू सीजन देयर इज अ न्यू मॉस्टर वेकना व्हिच इज रियली ब्लोन अप माय माइंड सो आफ्टर वाचिंग दिस सीरीज आई डिसाइडेड दैट आई वांट टू क्रिएट दिस मॉस्टर सीन सो व्हेन आई वाज बिल्डिंग दिस सीन आई डोंट नो व्हाट आई वाज डूइंग but the result was unexpected <laughs> let me show you the result This is the scene which I have created by using the blender. So let me show you that how I create this scene, and stay tuned with this video because it's time for the tutorial. So the very first, you need a character. so if i if i make character in blender and sculpt and retopology it will take a lot of time for me so to get rid of this problem i am using mixamo fuse for those guys who don't know what mixamo fuse is it is just a software which will create a character for you in just set of clicks let me show you how so this is the mixamo fuse If you want to download Mixamo Fuse, you can freely download from Steam. It is available free of cost. Mm. Can also show you. You can see. This is available on Steam. Okay, so this is the interface of Mixamo Fuse. Here you can choose your head, torso, legs, and arms, and your character will be ready. Okay. so i am going to choose this head so i am going to choose this head and then torso this will work for me arms i am going to choose zombie arm because our character is also much look like a zombie and this this legs okay so as you can see our basic character is ready you also can customize this character if you want like i want to be this character like this so also you can customize his face like i am playing with his expression okay so i want to be little bit angry yeah okay so it is looking fine so here is also clothing option if you want uh, if you want a character with clothes you can also choose the clothes but our character has not closed so we are skipping this part and we are go jumping to texture okay so i'm going to change his texture i'm going to change the color of this texture a little bit darker okay so as you can see our character is created okay so now you have to do is you have to take this to mixamo.com mixamo.com it is a site which will rig your character automatically So I'm gonna take this to mixamo.com for pose. Okay. So I just export this to OBJ. And okay. I have already exported, so I'm not gonna export it again. Okay. So I'm opening mixamo. You have to log in. So as you can see this is the site and I have already uploaded the character 
फ्रॉम हेयर यू कैन अपलोड योर कैरेक्टर पोज सो आई एम गो ना गिव पोज टू दिस ओके सो सर्च टी पोज जस्ट अप्लाई टी पोज एंड देन डाउनलोड सो आफ्टर डाउनलोड यू हैव टू टेक दिस टू ब्लैंडर फॉर स्कल्पिंग ओके सो आई एम गो ना टेक दिस टू ब्लैंडर आफ्टर ओपनिंग दिस आफ्टर इंपोर्टिंग दिस कैरेक्टर टू ब्लैंडर यू हैव टू गिव पॉज Okay, so after giving the pose, you have to delete the armature. Okay, so if I try to delete the bones, you can see our character is showing the default pose. To get rid of this problem, you need to first apply, and then you have to clear the parents of this object. Okay, clear parent. See, our problem is solved, and just delete the bones. Okay, so now we are going to sculpt this character. To sculpt this, we need to increase the segments. Go to add modifier and then subdivision surface. here you can add the value to okay so as you can see we get the lots of segments now we can sculpt this go to sculpt view so you can grab your graphic tablet if you have but if you don't have the graphic tablet it is not a necessary you can also go with mouse Okay so after finishing the sculpting I need to create a vines on this character so to create the vines you just have to go to edit mode by pressing the tab and then press alt and choose the edges and then separate these edges like this now you have to do is go to uh, right click on the edges and then go to and then go to convert convert to curve so as you can see our edges are convert into curves now go to curve here you can okay so from here you can give depth to your curves I like this. So as you can see, our vine-like structure is created. Okay, let me delete the unnecessary part. So you can create more vines by this method. like this separate selection and then parent uh, i mean and then convert to curves just to bevel it give that depth 
it's done let's delete the unnecessary part again here you can do like this just press alt s and you can see our veins is looking like this which is looking pretty good alt s okay so as you can see our modeling part is ready now we will go for the texture so i am gonna use substance painter for texture if you don't know that how you can take this character to substance painter and then get back into the blender you can check my previous video i have already tutorial on that okay so let's take it into substance painter so after texturing you can see it is looking way better than previous and i taken to blender so after that i have created a bigger binds and the house and then added my lighting setup and i also added a volumetric lights if you don't know that how we can add volumetric lights in the blender i will make separate video on that so after so after adding lights and volumetric you can see our scene is looking badass so now i have added some simple animation on this and you can see our scene is live and i also added color correction and some compositing techniques for adding realism in the scene so now i just press render so you can see our scene is done Okay, so that's it for today guys if you have any queries regarding to this project you can comment me down below and i will definitely try to solve your issues and uh, so that's it for today i'm signing off with the same words stay safe stay creative and bye bye